we're doing as Habitat for Humanity Puerto Rico is we're providing shelter shelter kits, and these kits allow families to go back into their homes. We're talking about people that have been out of their homes for over 40 days, 40 some odd days, uh, living with relatives or with friends, neighbors, and this is an opportunity to get them back to the homes. And when you're in home, when you're in your home, it makes you feel. I mean, it, it, it's 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 that feeling that you that you want to live. I mean, it's and it, and obviously helps people's morale. You get the Correct. economy back up. People start going out. They shop. They live at home. Correct. So how is you know how does Habitat fit into that, or maybe your philosophy of getting people back on their feet? So 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 what we as 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 a group as our mission is. Uh, we provide people with homes, but we, but we don't give them away. It's not an entitlement. They have to work for it, 400 hours, and they have to pay for us for a mortgage on, on the property. It's a non-interest mortgage, which varies around 150 to $200 a month, but at the, at the end, it's your house. So when you're talking to me about how that helps the economy, Will it provide a new homeowner with literally, not to be redundant, a sense of, of, owner, of ownership? And, and therefore, they don't have to worry about that part. You know, you have to worry about a million things in Puerto Rico, paying for bills, paying for food, paying for whatever. And the home is probably the most important part. And if you don't have that as a word in the worrying column and you have that on the uh, you got it solved column right. then it actually puts people at ease and you know helps them develop themselves as good Puerto Rican citizens do you have an assessment of how many homes were destroyed and how many you may step in eventually to help rebuild so the numbers I've been hearing is that around 200,000 homes have been impacted I don't know what percentage is, is total loss, but I'm sure it's a substantial percentage. And uh, our goal in the, uh, in, the, in the short run is to make that assessment. We have to look at places where we can be of impact and where we can be that helping hand for that person that gives them that leg up so they can basically continue with their lives and continue working and continue you know enjoying living in Puerto Rico and uh, we're looking at around 20 homes uh, Puerto Rico building in Puerto Rico is expensive and it takes time it's not just pulling up you know a, a wooden home and nailing it together it has to be poured concrete and it has to be stable to 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 outlast uh, hurricanes like this and I'm actually very proud that all of our projects made it through the hurricane without any issues. How many? Do you know how many homes you have here? So we have around 25 homes and all of our habitat homes were okay. Obviously you, you had minor damages here and there and you know some got water in and, and, and minor repairs, but the roof is there. What does Habitat for Humanity Puerto Rico need? Do you need money? Do you need, what do you need from people watching this video? So Habitat for Humanity's short-term needs are we're going to need a lot of volunteers to help get this moving and we're going to need donations to help buy the materials so our people can lift up Puerto Rico. And we're very effective. What we get, we put back. And when we get our, 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 our mortgage from, from, our, from our beneficiaries, we put it back into, into other, other homes. So it's paying it forward. How long is Habitat for Humanity Puerto Rico um, foreseeing it'll be here doing its work after this hurricane? Habitat for Humanity Puerto Rico is committed for the long run. We're going to be here uh, for 40, 50, 60 years, as long as it takes to, to get, uh, you know, eliminate poverty and eliminate the, the need for housing. That's our mission. Thank you. Claro. Appreciate it. Gracias.